Hi, my name is Bob Junior, and I'm a volunteer with the Martin Fleischmann Memorial Project. Okay, so we're going to do an experiment, an ultra experiment, with this Viv Real uh, ultrasonic, the original one that found the marks on the indium foil. And we are going to, in there, place a whole bunch of this aluminium kitchen foil, and we are going to use some distilled water. And then that whole setup is going to sit in this bag into which we will have some silica gel desiccant which has been uh, dried out. And then that whole thing will be run uh, and analysed using this Cirrus 2 uh, process gas mass spectrometer. And first we will run this for a period of time without the... Uh, ultrasound on just to get a baseline and then we will run it and then we will see if it is producing any gases I am looking to see if it will produce any hydrogen my hypothesis is that aluminium with ultrasound leads in water to the production of hydrogen and the hydrogen then plays an important role in aluminium being so effective uh, in the ultra experiment so in our nominal 43 kilohertz Vivreal ultrasonic clean here, I've put seven sheets here uh, of aluminium foil, uh, specifically this Reynolds wrap here in there. And I have been given this by Alan Goldwater, my colleague. And this is going to go on top here and provide the hard reflective Clocking polymer. Again, eh? Yes, Alan. Uh, <laughs> he gave me this uh, polycarbonate here, and we're going to have that to do the hard reflection. And the sound coming up from the transducer at the bottom of the tank uh, with the aim of producing some standing waves in the water column, and we'll fill it up to about the max point here, a little bit below the max point as we've done in the past. Lovely distilled water. And keep it just a little bit below the max line here because we're going to put in the polycarbonate holder here. And these polycarbonate holders happen to be just the right size. Okay. Get the washer in between there. Okay, something like that. Okay, so I had to drill a little hole here, as usual, uh, to let the air out. That means that the water is coupling the sound and not a air, head of air above the aluminium foil. Okay, so now it's ready to drop that down and place it in our bag and seal it up. So the idea is that the gas will, particularly if it's hydrogen, come out of the side here. Uh, hopefully, and come up to here, and um, we will have a sample of the Cirrus 2 in here, in between all of this silica gel. And then we'll seal this off, and hopefully uh, we'll maybe detect some gases. So the assumption is that the hydrogen is light, and it will come through this hole, and then the silica gel will be packed on top of here. And then we're going to tape that there, and then put another silica gel on top. Okay, here it is all bagged up. Uh, we can use the controls here. And you can see around the back here, that is where our sample line is coming down here. There, it comes down here, and then comes out with the power here. 